Okay, Jess and I are here gonna show you another way, there are several different ways, another way to get the back using the half guard. So I'm inside his half guard from the top, okay? So right here, I hold this bone, hold here, put my knee out. He's on top of his knee, not his groin area. Put his hand on the floor close to him. I'm gonna bring this knee in at the same time, the other knee, the right knee is gonna go towards his armpit and then slides toward his belt. So both knees are gonna be by the hip level. So I'm here, one, boom, still locking me. So initially, previously what I did, to get his back, I came all the way to the side, move my elbow to push his elbow and then come here and go get his back all the way and come in here. So now, a different approach, what I'm gonna do, once he's locking, the initial approach is the same because it's really hard to fight this arm. Try to get it here, keep his elbow on the ground, but it's easy elbow to elbow because I'm going towards the articulation. It's easier to beat that, the power of the biceps. So this time, while he's still locking, I feel the pressure, I put my elbow here, push, and stretch. So next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna roll my shoulder from here, push him away, get the control, adjust, and I have the back control. Let's go see that now, full speed.